and welcome back here to the hangar. We are going to Solaris, but first let's get uh, some uh, things out of the way. We need to repair and I think change our colors maybe. We did um, lose a PPCX, but hey, that was a hell of a fight actually. I feel like if you couldn't get through that, they don't want to let you into this thing. Um, we have a reasonable PPCX, don't we? Yes. And a medium laser. We're running low on the threes, yeah. That's okay though. We'll we'll buy more stuff as we find it. Um oh, I didn't even look to see if we could buy it. That's okay though. For now we we will get more blown off and be able to check again. What do we have on us? We have this new mech. Oh, this is our new um Highlander. Look at this fool. I'm not opposed to that guy, maybe. Let's just look at his loadout. AC20, AC20. Yeah, let's um... I'm gonna remove the supercharger. Oh. Uh, how do we... How do you take it off? There we go. Um... That gave us quite a bit of weight, actually, and jump jets. And let's put a better sword on here. Go the uh, assault claymore. AC-20, do we have better SRM-6s now? And can we purchase them? We should also see that. We have a three... Eh, I'll just look and purchase later. We'll we'll upgrade as we go. Medium laser ones, yeah, we'll just stick with it. And AC twenty rapid fire. I know we have a better one of those, don't we? Yes. We'll go with it. Get rid of our ammo. We might put it back. I don't know what I'm doing. Just looking here. 75 of 90 still. Let's, um... Max armor. That wasn't that much. And then, what else can we add here? We need to add... Heat sinks. And more ammo. Oh yeah, we're still 10 shy. What do we do? What do we do? You know what we do. We put a Gauss rifle on. Instead of an AC-20. That's ridiculous, kind of. In my mind. Um, we still so underweight. Hmm. Okay, I just loaded up here. Now we have medium pulse lasers, and we got a bunch of extra ammo and heat sinks everywhere, and we're just going to call it. It's always going to be a little under tonnage, I guess. Um, man, I hate sometimes when it does that. There we go. Let's paint. Let's see if this one will paint up properly. Yes, you will. We might start having to throw these guys in. You know what? Hmm. Nah, I like this one right now. We're going to stick with it. Uh, let's just edit the colors, though. All right, so here we go. I created a new paint scheme for fun. Um, I applied all. It still isn't applying to the Loader King. I mean, shit happens. We'll just let him be what it is. But I think we are... Oh, of course, there's always more to do. Um, in a fun way. Let's do some upgrades. Refined, refined. We're doing crazy with the... Uh, Oh, because we're working on, yeah, the Goss. Um, let's see here. Energy damage. Goss is ballistic, right? I don't think it's energy. Yeah. Um, energy damage. And then 
ballistic damage. Because we already have the range on it. We'll take it. 102 days after that. Yeah, so we're going to be eating up some time. But I think we are finally ready to go. Yep, yeah, and then we'll see. We're just going to keep picking up more and more mechs too, so let's depart. Greetings, Commander, from Dr. Wayne Dyer. Congratulations on securing your team's spot in the FedCom Unification Tournament. Your consistent success speaks volumes about your skill and determination. I can only imagine the caliber of competition you faced in the arena, and yet you still managed to emerge victorious. As you make your way towards Solaris, I feel it is my duty to shed light on a concerning development unfolding within the shadows of Solaris City. A group of ex-mech warriors known as the Inglorious Outcasts has been causing disturbances behind the scenes. These individuals, scarred by the unforgiving brutality of the arena, are now seeking to send a message through violent means. A recent defector from their ranks, often found drowning their sorrows in Solaris's taverns, has provided some intriguing information. Through careful surveillance and clandestine eavesdropping, my sources have uncovered discussions of a potential attack during the upcoming tournament at Steiner Stadium. It seems that these disgruntled ex-mech warriors, feeling marginalized and excluded, are planning to make a statement by disrupting the event. I will not reveal the identity of my employer on this. If the outcasts got wind of who is undermining them, they would face lethal consequences, and so would I from both sides. They would like to avoid making an enemy of such an unhinged group. Rest assured, I am actively pursuing further intelligence on this matter. As I gather, gather more concrete details, I will ensure to keep you informed before the tournament commences in earnest. I'll be in touch. Ooh. Well, uh, let's go. I thought so. Awesome. Pandemonium is raging downtown Solaris City. Moments ago, I caught up with Randall Logan, a member of the Inglorious Outcasts, the group suspected of commandeering the mech and setting it aflame. For years, the Solaris Games and others like it have offered great wealth and fame to countless victors. But they have also maimed or ended the lives of many others, all to the sound of cheers and applause. We call on those responsible. Blah, blah, blah. This sounds like boring nonsense. A big old nothing burger with extra cheese. Let's get down to business. Solaris, <laughs> the holy grail of mech -doo. Yours truly finally makes a triumphant return to these legendary arenas. Citizens across Greyland and Equatus and the entire inner sphere will watch as I blow up. <laughs> Metaphorically, of course. Burning to death is not my idea of a good time. But obliterating other mech warriors that are fighting in the Solaris arenas? Haha! <laughs> Count me in! Buckle up, Solaris! Fun. Daddy's home! I'm so excited. Can you tell? I really am. All right, so we are in Solaris. I want to... Actually, can we see... No, we can't. I want to see our relationship to the um, universe. That's okay. Uh, rare Goss, you say? Yes. Spend money for that. We're in the Mecca, huh? I, you would think there'd be a lot more on the weapons end, but maybe it, it, I mean, things will come. What else? Anything else here? Okay. Battle mechs. Oh. Yeah, our paint scheme will change over time, too. It's just to have fun with. I, I like the colors, but I'm, I'm not going to want to keep them forever. I can tell immediately. But it's fun to do something different. Um, nope, nothing special. Any pilots sitting here. I've seen it all. Now, I want to get paid for it. 
Captain Driver is a potential Meet 60. I know you I've seen it all. Now, I want to get paid for it. Idle We're hands in. are wasted money. Let's get out there, commander. Let's see. You know, I Abe, we maybe we'll keep him. I I guess we can just we can afford to keep people. Um I want to keep named people, you know? It's like, it's just our crew. Yeah, that's fine. We're good for now. Let's continue on. Mission briefing. It's good to be back. We're in the shit now. Apologies for the crappy meeting spot. My friend is a bit on the paranoid side. Now for a bit of history. These swamplands used to host a massive sewage treatment plant during the Star League era, giving the whole place that distinct aroma of, well, you get the idea but no time to stop and sniff those stinky roses. This location may not scream luxury, but it's perfect for covert meetings and clandestine dealings. Now, on to the juicy stuff. My contact, a real mover and shaker over at Solaris Arms, has been dishing out the deets on the cutting-edge mech R&D, and between you and me, they're at the forefront of mech ass-kickery. Here's the deal. I'm going to make a splash in Solaris. I can't rely on my old bucket of bolts. Nope, I need the latest and greatest, and Solaris Arms has the big guns. So let's get those big engines humming, hit the road, and kick this into high gear. We've got a few drinks waiting for us before the tournament kicks off, and you know I can't get past, can't pass up a good celebration or any reason to knock back one for that matter. Onward to glory. I've got history to make and fans to entertain. Swamped. Uh, Duncan Fisher has officially touched on the heart of the action. It's time to crank up the excitement, dust off those cockpit controls, and embark on an epic journey to claim the souped-up mech that awaits in the mysterious Bracken Swamp. Oh, you didn't think Duncan would come to Solaris without a little upgrade, did you? Well, this'll be fun. Or so we think. I just do salvage because we want to, yeah, always the have mission the potential. area is under a heavy weather warning. It's going to affect visibility for you. Um, what if we changed mech for fun and went with, what was the charger we were just putting together? Let's see here. Where are you? There's, oh, there it is. Yeah, let's go, let's go hang out with this guy for fun. shit now, buddy. My contact is set to meet us at the marked sewage plant. That's a crappy place for a deal to go down, but I need my souped up mech. Then I'll be ready to take Solaris by storm. Or should I say, shitstorm. You know what? I want my lasers just on the other one. I think we're good on that. Right, just so I have a, on my um, right bumper, kind of, or R1, whatever you want to call it. Love it. Just trying to get used to... I'm going to do this. Actually, same thing. Let's switch. Goss and the SRMs. So I got like distance and then there's my up close. All right, come on, Duncan. And then of course, the assault great sword did more damage. I think, just even as a one. Oh, we're just trying to get to the abandoned sewage plant. Okay. I'm like kind of forgetting like what the goal is. You want to sit down in Bracken Swamp? You are the highwayman to feed. Surrender, or the swamp will be littered with your sad remains. I prefer staying in one happy piece. Highwayman? You are the swamp. Engaging mercenary forces. 
go get in on it. Tell me, what's so special about this mech? Not a clue, but 
I've got a friend who tells me he's been playing with recovered Helm Corps tech. The cutting edge of mech-ass kickery. Maybe I shouldn't be trying to blow everything up, but... Alright. I just feel like that's dangerous. That's dangerous. That's dangerous. <laughs> I don't want to walk in and blow up things. You're either brave or stupid for showing your face here, Fisher. I'd say a solid mixture of both. There we go. That's so honest. This is your friend, huh? In a manner of speaking, come to take his mech. The arms of the boy sea bills. They paid you to showcase a mech. Instead, you showed how to lose miserably. You need to pay up. I'll have the money once I win the tournament, but I need that mech to do it. That wasn't the deal. You want the mech? You got to play for it. Oh my god. Well, it's a good thing I brought someone to do my fighting for me. Me too. Some uh, friends from Vampire Stable. Sounds like they've been right in the laid inside wooden coffins. My boy will happily oblige and put them in their place. Oh, now your friends are shooting at us, pal. Guess you're real popular in these parts. Yeah, this is a much oh, yeah. warmer welcome than I'd like. We're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. Looks like the vampires are riding off into the dawn. All right, I cleared out the swamp and saved your ass <clears throat> again. Always. Hey, my ass is very grateful. Fun. That was a good one. What else we got? I want some more mechs. We should use that loader sometime. Alright, 33. Not a whole lot. That's okay, we'll just take that. Alright, Duncan Fisher. Well, Travis Sh Shirk turned out to be a real piece of work. I mean, I didn't expect a red carpet, but I sure as hell didn't think they'd try to put a cap in us. You know, I'm usually real good at talking my way out of trouble, but this, they weren't just pointing a gun at my head, they were firing at it. So let me fill you in on why I skipped town from Solaris in the first place. See, a while back, Solaris Arms sponsored yours truly to flaunt their fancy mechs, and let me tell you, the pressure was on. But here's the kicker. I had a rough patch of losses, and the fans started whispering that I was throwing matches on purpose. Can you believe it? They thought I was so good at being bad, so I cooked up a plan to sharpen my skills, make a grand comeback, and win the, back the heart of Solaris fans while clearing my debts. I was sure that once I got my hands back on my mech, I'd be, it'd be smooth sailing, but let me tell you, the waters just got a whole lot choppier. The souped-up mech we just grabbed? That turns out, turns out it's rigged with a nasty kill switch. Travis gets the last laugh this time. My trusty old rust bucket is too banged up for a quick fix, leaving me high and dry with nothing to roll into the tournament with but my skin, bones, and sharp tongue. And even I know I can't use my words as ammo out there. So Mason, looks like you're going to have to brave the arena without old Duncan Fisher by your side. Think you can handle the heat without my flair? It ain't going to be a walk in the park, I, but I know you got the skills. As for me, I'll be waiting for the next tournament to swing around so I can strut my stuff. In the meantime, I'll be in your corner, cheering you on and offering up my unbeatable expertise and colorful insights as you blast away, blast your way to championship glory. Oh, okay. So for now, he's not going to be right by our side. Let us just repair. Anything amazing? Anything? Bueller? I'm not seeing. SRM6. Not amazing, but worth picking up. 
Assault Greatsword. Two. I think that goes on our guy here eventually, but we'll we'll just have to remember it. Um, unless, yeah, I think we're good. Marauder three R. No, no, no. Okay. Doctor Wayne Dyer. Commander, my probe into the underbelly of Solaris City has been riddled with difficulty. The shadows harbor unforeseen dangers at every turn. Mafia and Yakuza agents lurk everywhere. The last thing we need is one of these groups catching wind of your presence and becoming involved. Thankfully, I've built a career on dodging trouble and keeping things under control. No small feat in this cesspool. If I fail, the party that hired me to help foil this plot will ensure... My days are numbered. The level of heat will be too much even for me. So for both our sakes, maintain your reputation. The latest intelligence reveals that the Inglorious Outcasts are plotting to unleash their assassin during the grand finale, precisely when the Solaris Council will be gathering in a view box within Steiner Stadium. Cunningly, they've infiltrated the arena's ranks with covert agents poised to compromise, to comprise the protective ballistic shield protecting the spectators, oh, compromised, yeah, protecting the spectators, and the Solaris Council. Once the shield is compromised, the assassin will have a clear shot at their target. It's imperative that you overcome these obstacles, or merge victorious, and thro thwart the outcast's plan. If one of the teams takes you down, nothing will stand in the way of the outcast's plan. The fate of Solaris and the lives of the Council hang in the balance. The pressure is on, Commander, but you're no st stranger to adversity. Keep living up to your reputation and get the job done. So we have to win so that we're in the winner's box at the end when everything goes down. Sure, okay, I mean, fine, we'll do it then. Uh, let the games begin, it's showtime. The Let the Fedcom Unification Tournament begin. The thrilling affair kicks off with a team free-for-all battle, duking it out for the chance to fight in the finale and thwart the assassination of the Solaris Council. Okay, well, let's see. Um, I think, I think we know we're doing salvage, right? Eight million dollar payout. They're not playing around. And 400 tons. Well, let's go in hard. Like, what's our, um... I want to go with my Banshee. Because I really like it. What if we... I'm tempted to put some Highlanders in there. Actually, we might want to. Um, that might be fun. Let's... Put you in. And... Where was my other one? Yes, because you were fun too. And then, what do we want as an anchor for the final mech? What do we have for assaults? An Atlas, an Annihilator, Stalker, or what is this? A dual PPC? No, I think we might want Medium Lasers, PPCX. Oh, Jesus. I forgot about my Battle Master there. Um, but he's only, yeah, let's go, let's anchor it with a. Yeah. There we go. And we need to fix him up next time anyway. So let's go with Serena. Actually, Serena should be over here. We'll go Stabjorn and we got Stapleton. Let's go with Shintaro Abe. You can be our anch anchor. I want to see if you sound cool or if we want you in this or what. Um, okay, I think we're ready to go. We're only 25 under. Let's see what they throw at us. I think we're gonna melt it. Tournament's just about gonna to be get confident. underway, Commander. It's imperative you make it to the final match. The Inglorious Outcast Assassin is set to appear during the finale when the Solaris Council is seated in their viewing box and the protective ballistic glass has been compromised. I've gotten word the agents working for the Outcasts are attempting to sabotage the glass as we speak. We know why you're here, Mason. Bow on, or you'll end up at the wrong end of a violent blood match. That's an offer you should refuse. 
I know it'll be tough, but do you think you can make it without me, Mason? Yeah, I, uh, I think I got it. Here we mm. go. Another Fun. tournament in Steiner Stadium ringing in the new year. The opening match of the FedCom Unification Tournament. Target. This tournament is brought to you by... The, all the corrupt match fixers of the glasses that have infected Solaris. The worst kept secret. Genius Terry here is insulting the sanctity of the games, and the great houses, and me. And his delivery is so bland. His voice is in dire need of some spicy seasoning. This match is a team free-for-all, but it doesn't matter. It's all predetermined anyway. This guy is playing with fire. That's usually my brand. All right, guys. I'm trying not to get myself. I thought people were up here already. I was... Maybe they were before. There we go. Oh my god. Ammo ruptured. That was lit. Hey, my gears. Mm, they're down to one leg. This could spell the end for them. Oh, this match is producing a lot of excitement. What? Like this newbie, Jake Mason has a Oh my spark. god. Hurry up. Hey, he's about to be taught a lesson. Looks like the old man's not wrong. They're gunning for you, buddy. Oh my god, yeah. You're just in the way. Yeah, I've heard that over the years. I'm starting to feel a little personal. And it looks like okay, they're okay. up on the rookie. I'm sure this is just a coincidence. Oh my god, it wasn't those... planned. Let me toast my wobbly pop to Jake Mason. Come on. Another bright star. Bright star. Double fade. Oh my god. Quick. He's gonna come up and just murder me. Oh baby. Sounds like he's really choking on his words up there. What a shame. Oh my god. I blew his arm off at least. Get in there. The commentary isn't helping. But are you not entertained? We are. Not the word Marauders. Oh my god, we're so close. Eat, eat, eat. Who's gonna punch me in the face and kill me? Punch me in the face and kill me. got messed up, but it was a good fight. Serena's. Yeah, I uh, got a knack for it. But we won. Top shelf performance, Mason. This one. proven to be a great mech warrior and sidekick. A sidekick. Finally at the high point of my career. And now there's an empty seat in the commentator's booth. And you know what? It's calling my name. All right. Let me get some good commentary on the next one. Where are we supposed to go? That's it, right? Let's do it. Very cool. 
Welcome to Solaris. Nine million. Okay, and oh, well, we already have one of these, don't we? Oh shit! Is this the four A? Hold on. Oh my god, we got our Marauder too. I'm super stoked. Even PPC, PPC, lays oh, it's just it's heavy. It's more armor. That's so cool. Heat sink. Heat sink. Thing. Oh, medium laser. And that's awesome. All right, uh, just two points. Just do that. There we go. I'm so stoked. And we all. The. One Highlander just got torn up by something. Other than that, everybody else was doing great. Incredible. Oh, and a Cataphract. I don't... What's the Cataphract have, though? AC5, Rapid Fire. See, it's a fun Cataphract. Uh, incredible work making it to the final stage of the tournament, Commander. Are we already in the final stage? I'm gifting you a final reward bonus before the final match kicks off. I hope... This sees you through to the end and helps you stop this assassination attempt in its tracks. Well, there'll be more tournaments, so this is just this tournament. Got it. Let me just get our stuff together. You, sir. But we wanted the better salt great sword anyway. Everything else was good. SRM six. And anything else? Nope. This is my guy, right? Oh, cool. I'll take it. Just hit it and go. And repair. Fine. Let's get to the next one. Dr. Wayne Dyer. Outstanding work, Commander. Your performance inside the Steiner Stadium is creating quite the stir, solidifying your name here on Solaris. You, If you get the job done, you might want to consider a career on the arena circuit. You could make a killing, but first things first. The coordinated effort of those rival teams attempting to bring you down were no coincidence. The outcasts were clearly aware of your presence, which made your ability to rise to the challenge even more impressive. I'm not sure how your involvement was leaked, but that's another problem for another time. I told you Solaris is a cesspool. Trusting anyone to keep a secret is a life-threatening endeavor on Solaris. I'm afraid the most lethal part of this task still remains Mason. The Outcast's agents still maintain control within the arena. Their plan is to sabotage the protective ballistic glass shields. Shielding the Solaris council and crowd is still in play. The situation is a powder keg waiting to ignite. Considering the Outcast's successful infiltration, it's only a matter of time before they unleash their heavy hitter, but they will abide their time until the council is at its most vulnerable. I'll be keeping a watchful eye on the unfolding events and will alert you the moment the protective shield comes down. It is imperative that you utilize the repair bays as needed. Failure to do so will result in their assassin tearing through everything in its path and plunging Solaris into chaos. Stay in the fight, Commander, and be ready for my signal. Hold your ground amidst the chaos. The future of the Solaris Council rests in your hands. The climactic struggle within Steiner Stadium has arrived. Success is thwarting the outcast assassin is in thwarting the outcast assassin is paramount. As failure could lead to the demise of the Solaris Council and thrust the system into chaos. No pressure though. Let's Um and I just realized before we even do this. We have a Marauder too. I, I got into like too excited here. Um, Griffin, move to cold storage. You, let's take it to the bay. Just repair all for fun. And then we start playing around here. 
because PPCX is where it's at right now. And I believe this could also be a PPCX. I don't care about jump jets. I think we will definitely go with some um, double heat sinks. So that we can just tear through some stuff. And I'm okay that we don't have super long distance. I think I get enough out of it. Um, also max armor, just so we're there. Medium laser short burst. Is there anything we'd rather have? Eh, I'm okay with that. So, at this point, we're all energy. We still haven't evened out on cooling, huh? That's okay. I mean, it's all heat sinks if we have all this weight, right? What else are we supposed to be carrying? That's crazy. Because... What am I missing? Nothing. I'm going to keep adding heat sinks then so we can just... Fire um, over and over and over. There, perfect. And we need to do our upgrades for it. Refined armor and obviously energy damage. Range and velocity isn't a bad one. Energy damage and... It's not lasers, so heat dissipation, ballistic... Heat dissipation. There we go. And that's a bunch of money, but I love it and we just have to paint it. You know what, this deserves a better paint job, so let's fix it. Okay, so this is what we have. Some weird... We'll see if it uh, messes anything up to try to use that. I think it looks cool. Um, let's get at it. Yeah, our next thing. Uh, deploy, right? Do we want to use our Banshee again? Let's see. I say we go in with our Marauder. We can wait the time. Who gives a shit, right? If they're gonna let us. 221 days, Jesus. Insanity. I guess a little loophole in the uh, in the tournament. Hello there, mech fans. Duncan Fisher here, filling in for Terry. We should check our weapon groups just real quick. Um, I'm going to put, I think, one, two, and then I like that there. Let's see if this feels right. It could have been poison or natural causes. Actually, I want two, two, and one, just so it feels nice when I pull the trigger. I'm sure no one will look into it in the spirit of self preservation. That's two. It's all come down to this, Mason. That's My one. info has the inglorious outcast about to compromise the ballistic glass shielding the crowd and the Solaris Council. Outlast the other teams and make it to the finale. They'll unleash their heavy hitter once they know they can take a clean shot. <laughs> no pressure, huh? Okay. Come on. Dust off another opponent. And I 
should have like what infinite heat. You're gonna start picking on me in a minute. Let's use some cover. Got one behind me, I think. Got somebody hitting on me. Okay, try and. He blasts his opponent into another dimension. Fun. Running into problems after getting his leg blown off. Jesus. Oh, there we go. Jesus. Who was in there with the little guy thinking they were going to take everybody out, huh? Punching some numbers here. Jesus. Well, the Marauder 4 is a success. Oh, come on. Jesus, who's on me here? This guy. There we go. Yeah, I am. Oh my god, here. There we go. Activate repair bay. Let's go. I didn't realize we had more. There are repair bays positioned across the arena floor that will help these mech warriors not get blown to dust. That's obviously very helpful. Going after repairs. Let me in. How much should we get? Still got some yellows and reds. Mason has Ooh. made it to round two. And I haven't been dragged out of the broadcast booth. A win-win. Jesus. Oh, Nelly. His leg was just pulled off like a cheap piece of Lego. I hope nobody steps on it. He just mopped the arena floor with another opponent. Oh, I'm a big, chunky bastard. I get it. My god. Yep, he's tearing me. You're doing good, little guy. Okay. Oh, again. Okay, come on. This is tough stuff. Tough, tough stuff. Come on. My God. The match takes a vicious turn. This battle is really taking its toll. And metal wins. He just lit up another opponent. There we go. My boy could do this blindfolded. No, no. Calm down. It's intense. 
something to fight it over here a little bit. He just dispatched another opponent. Smoked his opponent like salmon. Like, like smoked salmon. the last one these combatants are being swatted away like flies mason is unbelievable justin allard has nothing activate repair bay oh geez let's go this is your final warning mason stand down or you will be leaving in one piece can i make it to the repair bay how long are they going to give me um i'm a fan I saw we just took another one down. Maybe we get to pick up another Marauder. Kind of ridiculous. Maybe they're just going to give me all the time in the world to get here. Stop it decided now. to offer up a snooze fest instead. Oh, Thanks once again, you're doing pretty good. As round three is set to go. A round brought to you by insert tournament sponsors here. Hey, give me a break. I had to fill in on a They're not right behind folks. me. We're just gonna uh, sneak through here for a sec. Oh, there he is. I love it. Let's go. Oh my god, I'm getting toasted here. Took out another opponent, making it look easy out there. A killer blow, and another one bites the dust. Fun. Well, I think we're adding up on those urban mechs. I think it's 12 total we gotta blow up. Oh yeah. Feel like I should go get that annihilator. Hot damn! That looked like a real blast. Target acquired. Oh, something's trying to beat me. This metal twig just got blown right off. Really being kept at an arm's length. There we go. There goes a leg. He'll be limping through the end of this match. Oof, Maybe he knew I was trying to lock on him. Lost a piece of hardware. Talk about a parting gift from his opponent. Oh baby, it's gonna be a real tough climb for him without that okay. leg. There we go. My boy is facing some adversity out there. His firepower has been reduced. Let's see how he responds. I should be faster than an Annihilator. Somebody, okay, the there you go. Where you at? Offensive capabilities just took a big hit. Okay, how many more we got? Expecting him to be dead. Okay. I 
All right, there's two more here somewhere, hiding in a corner. A precision shot lands. There we go. There goes a metal limb. Oh, they're really coming unglued out there, folks. Duncan, Duncan, funny. I love the commentary, Terry. New They're both Toro. But do we have to go get... There's no repair bay now, huh? But I can't activate the repair bay. Oh no. Is this a glitch or is this just the way it's supposed to go down? Or was I up next to it? Let's try walking up again. There's a lot of uh, wreckage on the floor here. There we go. These mech warriors are acting like chumps, not champs. They need to start making things happen out there. Hey. You need to smooth up some of your uh, interface. Oh, we yeah. have Caleb the Sledgehammer Rourke looking to smash my boy like a nail. Yep, well. It's hammer time. The Sledgehammer sounds like a real tool. Why don't you leave the one-liners to the professionals, buddy? Don't let him get a clean shot, Mason. Nothing to worry about. These mech warriors are trading blows and verbal barbs. This is my kind of scrap. It's time for Mason to go for broke. Throw everything but the kitchen sink at him. Unless he can find a sink lying around, then he should absolutely lob it at him too. Jake Mason brings the hammer down on work and wins the match to become the champion of the FedCom Unification Tournament. And it looks like no spectators were harmed during the match. And if they were, you won't hear about it from me, because I like my new job, and I like breathing. <laughs> and you're in a job that needs you to keep talking. Seems like a good fit. Indeed. The new year crowns the FedCom Unification Champion, and most importantly, a new Solaris commentator. Assuming the great houses don't hit the mute button, you'll be hearing from me shortly. All right. Now what? Um, bunch of interesting stuffs. Oh, we're trying to what? Collect an assassin. So I guess I, I'll do it for that. Oh, PPCX. What are we doing? SRM six. Medium laser. Medium lasers. That's a big deal. Ah, uh, not worried. Um. Anything else? Double heat sinks. All of them, right? Or as many as we can get. There we go. Impressive work, Commander. You're not o you not only stymied the outcast assassin, preventing a catastrophic, catastrophic event on Solaris, but also helped fill the void left by the departed commentator. In a business teeming with deceit and posturing, your actions spoke loudest. Your name and reputation have earned considerable weight, a testament to your exceptional performance. While Solaris offers a lucrative arena for your skills, should you decide to venture beyond and ply your trade across the inner sphere, rest assured you'll top 
the list of my recommendations. However, discretion is a valuable currency in our line of work. Let's keep this job and details under wraps. I'm still investigating how the outcasts got wind of your tournament entry. Stay being vigilant is key to survival in this business, after all. Best of luck, Commander. May Solaris bring you both good fortune and challenges in equal measure. I'm super stoked. I see a Corsair, and I thought the only Corsair was the Hero Mech. So this is the XTI. Now the Corsair, one of them I have, had a well, the ones I'm used to are at Gauss rifles and things. Oh, this is not bad, though. Well, that's awesome. Hello, folks. Duncan Fisher here, your new and improved Solaris commentator. Shout out to Commander Mason, the tournament champion and saver of my bacon. Thanks to him, my voice echoes across Solaris into your living rooms. <laughs> You're welcome. Remember, if you follow your dreams, fail upwards. Don't die in the process. Benefit from being a beloved character. Wait for the right people to kick the bucket. Anything is possible. Stay tuned, and I'll see you in the arena. Is there any actual more mission? It was this. You know, now it's just us fighting and having fun, because that's great with me. Stay tuned, mech fans, and I'll see you in the arena. Oh, here we go. See you in the arenas. Happy New Year, partner. It's been one hell of a ride. A blast in more ways than one. It's amazing what you can accomplish when you ride the coattails of a badass. I know we got into a few tight spots, but the end has justified the means, hasn't it? Okay, I didn't mean to turn... Didn't become a tournament champion, but I became the voice of Solaris. Take that, Ava Masters. She'll be eating her words and forced to listen to mine back on hardcore, but I digress. I suggest we hit up the Valhalla Club for some celebratory drinks. We'll toast to Terry Z. Rip. I'll do him proud by doing a better job as commentator and not boring the inner sphere. A fitting tribute. And we'll have a drink to our journey, buddy, the lovable loudmouth and the smirkless smirk in our epic journey to Solaris. You should really think about sticking around. Become my color commentator. With endless wit and your dry delivery, we'll keep Solaris entertained for ages. Plus, if you're next to me, the Highwaymen, Solaris Arms, and pretty much any other enemy I've ever made or will make won't mess with me. But I get it. You're a true mech warrior at heart. You should jump into the arenas and let me call your matches. From Boreal Reach to the Iron Mountain, and you'll have what it takes to become the next Solaris champion and I'll really sell it. You fighting and me talking, an unbeatable combination. And we have an annihilator. Energy, oh my God, an energy annihilator. Yes, I think so. So are we basically, yeah, that's, I think we're almost good, right? Here's, okay, where is Solaris, by the way? Just so I remember, okay. Um, yeah, that's pretty awesome. What do they have for contracts here if we had it? Steiner Stadium Shootout, Medium Duel, 2v2, Medium. So I think we just kind of go up the ranks through it and then see what happens there, see if any, any other missions get brought to us. Let's, um, repair. And let's see here, what else did we just get? That a sat. Do we have... I thought we had a turn in. Or are we trying to collect more than one? What do we have here? Collect two assassin mechs. Okay. I just want to go to the mech market and see here. Nope. I can't believe we got a marauder. Um, what the hell is it? 4A. I'm super excited. That's kind of been a mech I've been waiting for now. I'll look at, you know, others. Oh, I know what we got. Took me a second. Let's move to cold storage here. Um, We got a Corsair. And an Annihilator. Jesus. Let's look at the Corsair. 
right, this guy looks awesome. I'm going to play around here for a minute, and uh, yeah, we'll see you on the other side. Okay, I turned him into PPCX and AC2 burst fire like machine. So we're going to go with that. And then we're going to do a little painting. All right, weird looking thing. I love it. We'll play with it over time. Um, we'll change the paint job, obviously. But let's do our upgrades. Refined and refined. Um, this guy's an auto cannon monster, but also has some laser. I'm going to go with energy damage and ballistic damage, I think. Heat dissipation and faster projectiles. And what else we got here? Energy damage. Awesome. I love it. So, oh, and we're going to do this one real quick. Let's see here. Oh, my God. Yeah, uh, I'll meet you on the other side of this one. Okay, this is ridiculous, but we're going to go with it. Um, yeah. Four PPCXs, uh, four medium lasers, and everything else is just uh, energy or, you know, um, heat sinks. Let's paint them up. There we go. For now, we'll all be the same. And let's do a few upgrades, and then we're going to go have a fun one here. All energy, right? Um... I'll do energy damage, but I think cooldown too. Heat dissipation, ballistic heat. There we go. Let's go with that. Okay, well, we're still on Solaris, so I don't see why we wouldn't just uh, go for a mission here. Steiner Stadium shootout. Um. Medium dual, medium, medium. Steiner's shootout is test your metal in this free for all without weight class restrictions. That's what I want. Not a whole lot of money for that. Okay, but oh, it's 100. We're going to change mech. What do we want instead? Let's go with our Corsair. And I just want to see what he looks like again. Oh, yeah. Let's let's just have fun with this one. I'm wondering why why do I have a large laser though? Oh, because it hasn't been fixed yet. Hold on, I get it. Okay, we wait the 114 days now. It has everything I was thinking. Yeah, the PPCX. Okay, well, let's go. You might have to change the um the weapon groupings. Secure your seatbelts, mech aficionados. A thrilling match is about to unfold, offering our pilots a shot at cementing their status as some of the best mech warriors on Absolutely. But before we do that, let's just check. Yeah, okay, I think we're good. CX. SRMs. Okay, there we go. Excellent. Got that missile Both damage. On the edge of their seat. Right. I'm trying to see how these. You bastard. We'll see how this shreds or not. What is going on? Oh, he got me right in the head. 
I'm having a hard time with this one. Okay. I'm being an ass because I'm in a new... new build. Oh my god, you bastard. about the AC2 burst fire. I might have to adjust what we're doing with them. Concentrate on some other stuff. Or throw out an AC10. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Fine. That's, uh... I don't know. Though. Maybe I'm wrong. Or take off the burst fire. Coming after me with that Clearly sword. The time spent with me, you rubbed off on him. Crazy. I'm tempted to try the annihilator, but oh, the next ones aren't um, heavies anyway. We'd be going with mediums. Oh, I love it. That was fun. Uh, we're so hop lomacus to Rudiarius. Level 5 we're working towards. Okay. Anything interesting here? A uh, double heat sink, I will take it. And then 33. There. There we go. Why not? Looking pretty good. Alright. Well, let's kind of hop out here for a second. It's December 20th, 3042. Um, we have a bunch of arena stuff to do. I want to keep exploring and playing on this game and see if some other things pop up and play some other missions so we're not done with the series yet. Um, I'm really enjoying it. Let's see how high we can get in our arena fame and see what it has in store for us and let's do it all in the next episode.